A Muskegon school will be celebrating an accomplishment today that's been years in the making. Nelson Elementary School is no longer on a prior a priority school list. 24 Hour News 8's Catherine Ducharme joins us here in the studio with what this means for Nelson. This is new on Daybreak. Catherine. Hey, it is, and I talked with the principal about what it means to no longer be on the priority school list. We also talked about how they can keep it this way for the future. When you're identified as the lowest, one of the lowest performing schools, um, it's, a, it's, a, it's a staff demoralizing for staff, it's demoralizing for, for parents. But we knew that our kids were better than those tests indicated. Muskegon schools received this letter from the state in April congratulating Nelson for no longer being a priority school. The news became public knowledge a few weeks ago. It's, it's a sign that we're doing the right work. Nelson Elementary School Principal Brian Gam says part of the reason is funding. The school received more than $2.2 million in federal grant money back in 2016. We do use a portion of the money for class size reduction. We have instructional coaches that are assigned to specific grade levels, and they work specifically with our teachers. Ready? Go. We meet every four to six weeks and look at student data um, to make sure kids are making the progress that, that they need to. But Gam says it couldn't have been done if it weren't for the staff. Adults really set the tone in a building. So when you create an environment where this is the expectation in terms of how you do things in a school, um, and then kids and families come in, they acclimate to whatever the culture is in that building. Now that changes are made, the big question is how to sustain progress. Yeah. The key is that the work that we're doing become habits. The kids, when they come into the school, this is how you do things at Nelson. We jokingly call it the Nelson way, uh, and that's the way we do things at Nelson. And this is how you act, regardless of where you're coming from. Another reason Nelson is no longer a priority school is the state redefined criteria of what makes a priority school. You can read more about those changes on our website, woodtv.com. We'll have them up shortly. Casey. A lot of hard work went into that. Thank you, Catherine.